Let me do this. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it the right way. All of it. Oh. I don't remember. Oh. oh God. No. Oh no. His dookie was just right there in my face. That's Tasha. That's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gon' eat a little, drink a little. Our story time is the best. Have you L O L when you click play? No, this ain't no click. What up, y'all? I'm back with a solo seafood if you new thank you for subscribing or checking us out if you didn't subscribe yet watch the video if you hate me check out my wife you might like her welcome to the family and welcome back y'all know y'all know what it is today i'm eating crabby crab i had it delivered because i didn't want to go get it it's about 7 7 30 8 o'clock at night and normally we don't eat this late but i'm doing it today because i'm hungry so there we go let's get into the video i'm back and today i have crawfish half a pound i had a crink 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 <clears throat> That you, um, you had, you, you, you can. King crab? Thank you. King crab, shrimp, and some potatoes, a couple sausage. So I'm just going to, I'm just going to eat. I'm going to try a shrimp first. I'm not going any further than my fingers, though. They are already nicely coated. Mmm. Mm hmm. That's great. Oh, and today we have, um, we have a topic. I do have two topics, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get into both topics. My finger is about to get dirty. Let me do this like my brother. Oh! Hell yeah, you better get it! Make that, that mess. No. Make it squirt. Get out of my video! Get out! Okay. Get out of this living room! Okay. Shit. You always got to be extra. Sheesh. I wonder where you got that from. Why every time I do a solo, I feel like I can't get the crab out. So when, you, when it's me on there, you can get it out? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. I think I'm just trying to prove something. <laughs> and I don't know how to eat. Oh, baby, can you give me the crab cracker? It's so small. It's hard to get in. Why are you looking at my food? Oh, that king crab looks great, huh? I'm hungry, you guys. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna do these little legs first. Here we go. You better crack work. The, crack the other end. Like bite this. Up, back bite. Pass. A little pass. And then that. Now I'm trying to pull out this. It should come right out. Yeah. Ah, okay. Hmm. <laughs> Don't come for me. Don't even come over here towards my plate, baby. I'm not. This is just for me and me only. I don't know why you're not sitting down. Why are you standing up over my food? That's what I want to know. I like watching you eat. Okay, but you seem nervous. You moving back and forth. Um, I don't know. You're making me nervous. Shut up. Ooh. Oh, that's sweet. Mm. I think I just ate a plantation. I mean a plantain. Whatever. Mm, mm, mm. Just another creature. Yes, yeah, true. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Hold on, y'all. Oh, I don't even have to <clears throat> read the topic. I'm happy. I just get to eat. Mm. Good. Every, mm. Mm. <laughs> Get sit down. What? Get. I know you didn't say nothing, babe. I don't want them to see that trash. I don't know. Come on now. Yes. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, seafood. <laughs> Come on, potato volcano. Just like that. I'm not eating any more potatoes because I want to eat. Right, and they can get you all stuff. Yeah, I'm eating one potato only, y'all. This is the only potato volcano y'all getting. Ouch. Oh, that hurt. Here you go. That looks delicious. Mm, 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 mm. Uh, I'm over here happy, smiling. You know you greedy when food makes you smile. Yeah, uh-uh. Yeah, uh-uh. You just greedy. 
You're just greedy if you smile while you eat. Mm -hmm. I dance, that's my wine, so. Now, this sausage is so good. Do you have a preference on which topic I do? One, because I told her, I told her that I would do it. The other one I told her I may if I get a chance. So the first one, the longest one, okay. is the one I have to do. Alright. Alright, so should I start now so we can both come in or what time are you at? <sighs> so she good. Eight minutes and 42 seconds. Let me do, um, let me do this. I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it the right way. All of it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Go away. There we go. Said you were gonna do it. <laughs> <laughs> Suck it. Suck the head. I'm gonna do it. That's just butter. Neck butter. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Ooh. Oh well. Some juice? Mm -hmm. It didn't look like you got any just at all. No, I didn't, but I, I you squished it out the front. I did. Yeah. I know y'all like. Mm -mm, I don't even want to watch you eat it. Okay. Big. I'm gonna do it right, y'all. Uh. Okay, ain't nothing there. I got it's not here. Yeah, look, y'all. These some big ones. Mm. I really like crawfish. Yeah, they got some big ones. Mm -hmm. I really like crawfish, y'all. I'm gonna let her do one more and then I'm gonna start the topic. Go on and drink it, baby. Let it drip into your mouth. Hold your head back. Stop trying to push the juice out. Oh. Was it good? No. <laughs> 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 and I wiped it with the butter stuff. <laughs> Oh, 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 no. I like crawfish. Try to pull the bowl while it is. I don't remember. Oh, oh, God. No. Oh, no. His dookie was just right there in my face. Ah. Ah. I'm going to go ahead and eat some king crab, y'all. All right, we're going to I think I got some bad crawfish. Mm, they don't, I don't, I don't like the butter or whatever it's, mm, mm, no. Cuzzo, I love you. You gonna have to come do my seafood, my uh, crawfish for me. All of them. I don't want to clean them. I can't. I feel like I ain't right. Mm -mm. Topic number one, y'all. My husband, my one-year-old daughter, and myself had to move with my mom to San Diego because my husband lost, lost his job due to COVID. My mom's mood changed a lot. One day she's really happy with us and another day she isn't. My husband couldn't find a good job, so he has a part-time job where he works four hours, five times a day. What? Four hours, five times a day? I think she means a week. Oh, okay. And my mom is always telling me how he is lazy and he is useless, that he should be more like my brother, her son. She wants him to be a handyman and do everything around the house. And he tries, he really does. And he doesn't know how to do everything. She tells me so many things that I end up taking out on my husband, wow. Mm. And getting mad at him. Mm. Mm -hmm. I know it isn't his fault and I shouldn't get mad at him. I right. suffer from anxiety attacks and I can't help but start crying. I'm actually crying as I write this. Whenever she starts telling me that stuff, she just walks away. She is a very offensive person. Ever since having my daughter, I did gain some weight and she always com comments about it every single day. She says, my husband will eventually leave me. <laughs> wow. Your mom is the hot mess. She said the other day that whenever she gets hungry, she's just going to look at me so her hunger can go away because she doesn't want to get fat like me. I got sad and told her how rude her comment was. And she said she wasn't going to talk to me anymore because I get offended so fast. Every like, like, you, like you shouldn't get offended at something like that. Right. Every single day it's the same thing. She wakes up with something new to tell me. We can't move out because it's so expensive here in San Diego. And like I said, my husband works part time. I honestly don't know what to do anymore. It's too much. I get migraines almost every day due to the stress. This is not even half of the things she does or said. There's a lot more. Let me start real quick because I got something to say real quick. It's very simple. 
and it's probably we probably don't have to say nothing else your mom is insane a little she is she's a little she's a little she's a little touch not insane i shouldn't use that term well, i can use it she got some issues right so with those kind of people all you gotta do is she needs some love okay or she needs some she need her ass whooped or she needs some love she needs something right so all you got it's easy to manipulate those kind of people just instead of i mean i don't even know if you're coming out of anger i would be i'd be pissed instead of telling her hey you were wrong for, don't even come at her like that just be like do you think it would be better if i don't even know if that's how you started off but telling her you know it would be better if you would just say hey i think you need to lose some weight instead of saying every time i look at you every time i get hungry i look at you maybe you should tell her how she can say something the right way maybe she doesn't even want to say like or maybe she's mad because y'all live there and she wants you guys to leave you know people can love you but i mean some people will love you but they don't really want you in their home so they'll she's probably mad and saying all these things but if it's not that if it's just because only because she's insane then you could probably just make her change how she speaks to you but let me let stephanie go because stephanie gonna have something to say <laughs> okay stephanie's like shut up number one I, this is probably one of my biggest things that I Remember, she hate. stuck at her mom's yeah, house. I get you. But this is one, one of my biggest, like, it's not even a pet peeve. I don't know, like, things that just anger me. Uh. Is people who have children and treat them like shit. Or, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I feel like you are supposed to be your child's Forever. most safe, protected place yep. to be every, no matter what, all throughout their life. Mm -hmm. I should be able to go to my parents and they, yes, you give me advice and you, you give me, like, uh, even criticize me, but in a positive, loving way. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Not, you just talk shit about me like, damn, you mm -hmm. my mom. Mm -hmm. Ugh, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Ugh. Okay, so that's what, I, first of all, if anybody's out here doing this to their kid, please stop. Come on. We, I mean, you are, you are supposed to be your kids, number one. Fan, you know what I'm saying? period. One. Teacher, everything, their protector. If you're not. <laughs> you, nobody else should be treating your fucking child better than you do. Yeah, so you shouldn't even have Show one. Love. You Find know? somebody who really loves them and give them away. And if you don't know how to do that, you don't become a parent, okay? I'll say this. If you're already a parent and you don't know how to do that and you don't want to do that, you better be a good good man or good woman because i'm sure if you don't want to be a good parent you could probably be a good man and woman that's probably why you're not a good parent because you over here trying your best to be a good woman or man right okay Hello. so if Hello. you know you can't do it go ahead and find you a good man or good woman that you know is gonna love the kid be good to them you ain't gotta pay no attention to your kids since you don't already exactly. just find somebody who likes your kid that's it okay now what i have to say another thing i have to say is this like you say all the time we are all human. That that mom has went through a lot of bullshit. Yes. She basically has been raised to care about everybody else's image of her and mm -hmm. like society standards. Like she thinks very highly of society standards and, and the shit that <clears throat> she, she wants you to, you can't force somebody else to be with anything to be you. you want them to be. Yeah, Period. exactly. You know and a lot of parents do that and they die, may not even do it intentionally, but yes. they want, like I want you to have what I didn't. You know so. why? It's because she puts a high value on what people look at her as so it's like i raised this fat daughter you know what i'm saying mm. i was a bad mom because i have a fat daughter you know what i'm saying mm. that's what it is those people that could be that, they're worried about what their friends gonna say because you didn't graduate college you know what i'm saying you didn't raise a person who graduated college uh -huh. you raise a, a person that's not heterosexual all these mm -hmm. different things oh yeah so they're, they're embarrassed about this stuff they're they're i feel like those people are really really weak and mm -hmm. they they kind of push that off on you. And they're easy she to manipulate. That way. She wants you to be weak mm -hmm. and care about what everybody else thinks about you and not be happy with yourself. You got a, a man that's probably a good man, but he right now is struggling a little bit and she like mad as hell. All right. Instead of let me support this man and we gonna grow together as a team and be bomb as hell, bitch. Sit your well, ass down. Well, that's her problem. Be single. Mom probably ain't got no man. Girl, bye. Hello? This is my bitch. video. Sorry. I bet you the mom's single as hell. Don't nobody want to be with that? Don't follow her, girl. Keep doing what you're doing. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I was going to say that um, I feel like we skipped over this because we're talking about the mom so much, but she mentioned that she's treating her husband bad. You know? She, oh, yeah. Yes. Because that's of her that's mom. Good, that's another thing. Mm -hmm. that I don't talk about so... 
let me say something real quick before Stephanie goes all the way off. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, he's already in, just like you, he's already in a bad spot. He lost his job. He had stability, you know, in his life because he was the one working and whatever. And then he lost his job because of COVID. And he has a one-year-old daughter and a wife. And he lives with his wife's mother. Who's, <coughs> who's very rude and mean. And I'm sure he knows that she compares your child. Um, I'm sorry. She compares him to your brother. So think about that. He's not related to your mom, your brother, or nothing. You are. So you have that some, you know, some of that, some connection. He doesn't. So imagine how he feels in your mom's house, stuck somewhere with somebody treating him and talking to him bad. And then his wife, the only person that connects him to that person and probably makes him feel safe at this point, he needs you to feel safe. Because he's in an environment that's not, you know, safe for him. He can get kicked out at any time and your mom could be like, you can stay, but he can't. He doesn't, have, you know, she doesn't, you know, she's not, she doesn't owe him anything. <clears throat> so, one, what you don't need to be doing is beating your husband down. That's all I got to say about that. That's the worst thing you could do. Yeah, I think a lot of people have um, that problem. Not, not this problem right here, but I'm saying the problem of... Like even when taking things out on their partner. Yeah, and you like hearing different things, and then you're you're going and reacting to your partner yeah. in a way that you really wasn't even about to react to because somebody else is saying some shit. Mm-hmm. Because it's making you think. Yeah. You know when not. Not to say things should make you think, but you got to think about how it's making you think. You know what I'm mean? saying? Yeah. Like you just don't adopt somebody's ideas and beliefs just because. Yeah. You got to have a good reason mm -hmm. that makes sense for you, and not because. You want to live up to their idea of what you should be. You right. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. Sure do. I think <coughs> that you guys both need to come together, you and your husband, and y'all need to say, "My mom is insane. I got your back. You got my back. Let's That's stay a good here. One. Use that money as long as we can until we can get the hell out of here and we gone and we about to grow as a couple." You know? Good idea. Your mom. She doesn't have to know. She's not on y'all side. You guys are there together. Your mom is a is a huh, not a nice person. So I'm sure she's been like this your whole life. You might as well use what you can out of her. Because she never gave you what you needed anyway. So take all you can get. Don't take anything she says to heart because she's insane. And then when you leave, leave, you know. Don't stop talking to her when you leave. Let her see you doing better when you leave. Absolutely. Hey, mom. That's going to be the best. Send her something nice. Hmm. Hey, mom. Here you go. Yeah, this is something she can't. About. Yeah. Just got a promotion, but a little yeah. thanks. Bye. Mm -hmm. I'll be throwing everything in her face. Mm -hmm. I, I, I can't wait. Yeah. You can't wait for what? For her to do something? Yeah, I can't wait for her. Look at Stephanie thinking home. it's her own life. I'm telling y'all, she's kind of crazy. <laughs> Stephanie a little bit insane. <laughs> I can y'all hear her? Y'all heard her in the background talking about I can't wait. What are you talking about? Hey, it's not your story. Don't really keep me updated, boo-boo. She over here talking about I can't wait. What send you gonna pictures. do? Send me pictures of your mom's face. When you show her how y'all have grown, okay? When you started talking, I tried to uh I tried to do one, but I got sick. But I'm gonna try it now. Ugh. Why is the doodle in the front? Pull it. There you go. You got it out. You got it out. Yeah, That's but like, pull the I know. You want it out of there? Yeah. There we go. Mm -hmm. I still need to peel the back, y'all, because I don't know. You want to make sure? Yeah. <laughs> okay. There we go. Let's just take this. While she playing, y'all, let me get one. Let me even eat the shit before she does. That thing good. Ugh. Suck this, babe. I ain't Suck no crazy shit. Look. I don't know how That's the juice, y'all. I'm sorry, but I don't like the flavor. I don't know what. I mean, it is what it is. Y'all like what y'all like, but I don't like. I don't know what to call it. I don't know what the flavor is. It's mm. very. Mm. It tastes like what somebody would scrape off their tongue to me. You didn't look inside? No, I don't want to look inside. <laughs> I've already looked inside before. <laughs> look, y'all. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah, let me show. Let me, yeah, let me show. show that shit. Mm -mm. This is the inside. Y'all haven't seen it. You can't really see nothing, though. No. Not in that one. Here, here we go. Here we go, y'all. You see that? You want that? And that's what's inside the crawfish, and it tastes like tongue scrapings <laughs> of somebody with bad breath, though. Not even like a regular tongue scraping. Have you missed on the claw? No, I tasted it. The big claw? 
Uh-huh. They got some meat in here. We done with this video, y'all. <clears throat> um, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Let us know what you guys think. We got a vlog channel, Steph and Sasha Vlogs. Link is in the description below. Set your notifications to all if you want to be reminded of daily uploads, live streams, premieres. Until next time. Only your vibes. Peace.